Hello guys and welcome to the complete Android developer course created by Master Android app and the channel. So in section one, as an overview, we are going to see how Android and Java uh, works and how to install Android Studio and work with emulators. So first of all, as an overview, I will say, I will, we will look at what is so great about Android and what exactly Android and Java are. So how they work and comp and how they complement each other and what they that means to us uh, as future developers. So moving quickly on, we will set up the required software so we can build and deploy a simple first app. So as an overview, by the end of the ch this chapter, we will uh, have an uh, we have achieved the following: learned how Java and Android work together, set up our development environment Android Studio, which takes care of all the component involved um, components involved in building Android apps that we will learn about next. And third, we will learn about the Java Development Kit (JDK). The Android application programming interface API and how we use them through Android Studio. Fourth, fourth uh, thing we will learn how to build our very first Android app, and then deploy the application the app on Android emulator and run on our our app on Android emulator and a real device. That's a lot to get through. But uh, so let's get started. But first, rate us five stars on uh, the Play Store if you are uh, downloading Android uh, uh, Master Android app, and subscribe to our channel to get latest tutorials free with source codes. So, what is Android? This application is intended for readers who are interested in learning Android app development from zero to here. Trust us, you will be an Android master. So, what is Android? Android is an operating system designed with mobile in mind, the place where your phones, functions, and applications live. So, everything you see on the display of your device is a part of the operating system. When you get a call, text message, or email, the OS processes that information and put it puts it in a readable format. So, Linux. If you, you if you hear about Linux, so uh, you which is a great operating system. So Android is not a phone or an application, but is it is, but is an operating system based on Linux kernel. So no clue what that is. In its most uh, simplest simplest definition linux is an operating system most commonly found on servers servers and desktop computers android is not just a version of linux due to the many changes found under the hood but it is really related so <clears throat> till now we have learned that android is linux based the android os is divided into various version and num numbers implying implying significant jumps in the features operations and stability which usually usually have code names in later videos we will learn how the about the history of android so if you have if you hear someone say android lollipop marshmallow nuggets oreo or pie or even q or 10 that's just this is just the name of the version of Android you might have in your device. So, why why we are going to learn Android? It's been clear clear that Android is a force to be reckoned with uh, in uh, within the mobile OS landscape. So, this Java-based technology has sparked a new gold rush with programmers competing competing to make money from their mobile apps so uh, android is very uh, uh, learning android is an amazing th amazing thing 
that you should start making uh, you should start learning for making money for making uh, developing your uh, own apps uh, just for uh, uh, developing your uh, coding uh, skills and even uh, for your for prof making professional android apps and projects so how we learn android and how to uh, make android apps to be successful android developers need a good grasp of the java language or kotlin android apis and android application arch architecture it's so important to use an appropriate and effective development environment for many years ellipse ide with an adt plugin was the preferred platform for android development today it's Android Studio. Don't worry, if you don't understand what they are means IDE, ADT, you will learn in next videos. So, I will remember you that these lessons are presented and created and found in the inside the master Android app available for download freely on Android uh, on Play Store. So. If you are holding an Android device, or you are just uh, if you want uh, just uh, to learn what is Android and how it consists, Android. If you see in the left uh, section, we have a stacks. We have like five stacks. First of all, applications. Second layers is Android framework, the native libraries inside it, the Android runtime. Fourth uh, layer is HAL via HIDL, and then the base is Linux kernel. So, if you don't understand, not it is not a big problem because you are uh, uh, you are going through a new thing, which is Android. Now, let's move to see how uh, these applications, what uh, this layer uh, or what uh, each layer contains. If we see the application on the right side, the applications like Alarm, Browser, Calculator, uh, 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 Dialer, uh, Email, Home, SMS, Photo Album, these are applications you see in front of your phone and the user uh, see them. Underneath, we go further in the Android framework, which are content providers, manager, activity, location, package, window view system, and resources. If we go underneath, we see the native libraries to the left, audio manager, free type, SQL lit, surface manager, WebKit, and many other native li libraries and Android li uh, runtime like core libraries, Delvic VM, and ART. We will learn about them uh, in next uh, couple of uh, videos. Now, uh, uh, if we go to HAL, which is audio, Bluetooth, camera, DRM, input, media, sensors, and when, and so on. If we move to the base, we will see the Linux kernel. So what is Linux kernel? What it will contains driver, audio binder, Bluetooth, camera display, keyboard, keypad, shared memory, USB, power management, Wi-Fi, and all the hardware. So this is the uh, uh, about a uh, Android uh, consist what consist what Android consists of. So don't worry if you un don't understand. We will uh, we will clarify them in next couple of uh, videos, and uh, these are general information. We, we, they are good to know, but they are not necessary to learn in our process development process. I mentioned before that uh, Android is uh, based on Linux, but Linux is an open source. So Android is an open source operating system for mobile devices and corresponding open source project led by Google. Now, if we see the, if we remember this 
from the previous uh, this uh, picture and these are the layers of android from the previous previous lesson we will sh we will uh, learn or we know that android is an open source operating system for mobiles led by google htc dream was the first phone to use android os google released new versions of android on frequent basis till now google has released 15 versions of android from nugget uh, no, uh, donut to pie and android it's ha uh, android it's has come a long way till the uh, to the latest uh, version of android called android 10. it's grown out of its awkward phase and is now one of the best performing OS in the market but there is always room to grow more the new version of Android is released soon and named as Q10 in future Google is going to release all in one operating system called Fuchsia that will support every platform from smart smartphones to tablets even laptops and desktop PCs till now this is an introductory uh, uh, introductory um, video we have learned about Android and what consists of and what is based on. Now, in next video, we will learn about the Android versions and Android history. Thank you guys. Don't miss to like, subscribe and comment below. Rate us 5 stars on, uh, on uh, Play Store while downloading master android app thank you guys see you in next videos next videos